Hey guys, welcome to Daily Entomologist. And today I am checking out the C.P. Gillette Museum of Arthropod Diversity here at Colorado State. And uh, it's going to be fun. All right, so we're in the entrance. Um, here's their mission statement. Go through that slowly. If you want to pause, read it, you can. Hopefully it'll come in good. I got a little viewing room right here. And this is actually a whole new spot they moved into this past summer. So they have a, be able to greatly expand their collection. Some blow up photographs. We got drawer of mods here. Don't mind the background talk. Got a Harlequin beetle. What a gorgeous coloration and the very long four legs there. More tropical species, morpho, bird wing, beautiful swallowtail. Let's see if we can capture the green on there. And we got the atlas moth. Uh, random beetles, uh, tarantula hawk. Got a cicada killer there. Oh wow, that one was actually collected here in Colorado. That's a, that's a big... Uh, sorry with the glare, I'm trying to... Get past the glare here. We got some more butterflies here. These ones are all North American species. Whether these are all collected in Colorado or in the not, I suppose I can actually check. No, not all of them. Some of them are. And there's Colorado, Arizona, different localities, but these are all North American. Awesome, awesome. So, I'm going to go take a look through some of these. All right, so. There's a Lepidoptera down this row. Man, this glare is terrible. Circionis. Otis, O E T U S. Um, I think you pronounce that. Those are all that genus. Um, so we have in here.
Yeah, the pearly eyes. This drawer out. Oh, look at that. We have a few different morph of species. It doesn't help with the light right above me. Yet. But now you get a little better look there. Oh, look how shiny and bright that one is. And this one, this is my favorite morpho right there. Beautiful, look at all that. Mm -hmm. let's, let's try down in here. Stuff in there. These are all nymphality. Oh, these are tropical ones. Ooh, I like that one right there. It's kind of exciting not knowing all of these. Oh, we have a uh, Euphydrias. Phaeton, Eterna, Gelati. Oh, those first two bats were from uh, Southeast Asia. Absolutely gorgeous. Look at those. These are these ones are all North American. Um let's see. This cabinet has uh, Lassio Campoidiae and Saturnity. Let's check it out. Ooh, look at the paints on that. That's gorgeous. Some more rosy maple moths, oak worms. Those are gorgeous. There's so many species here I haven't seen before. It's kind of nice. Sorry if I'm talking a little bit quiet. I hope you can actually hear me. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. This is so exciting. And I apologize about my random rambling. I'm kind of excited. I actually get to explore this awesome, ginormous collection.
<laughs> Imperial Maws, Hercules, Imperialis, uh, Aslari. for the shaking. Trying to get that back in there. This one's kind of the same. find some other orders to look at. Well, we got some Erebidi. Give you a look at some different other moths you normally really wouldn't see. Ooh, those are really pretty. seen many of these species before. This is awesome. Look at the reds and oranges and pinks. species. Wow, wow, wow. The Lepidopter collection in this museum is amazing. I hope you're having as much fun looking at these as I am. Though, it is a little different being in video, but... Okay. Now I'm gonna go look for another order to look at. I got distracted. All right, we found some Hymenoptera. It's a little bit darker in this spot, so sorry. It's gonna be a little bit more difficult to see. Yeah, it is a little bit too dark, so I probably won't look too much at these. 
that all these are uh, unidentified, apparently. Well, it's not really sorted. They're kind of all mixed around in there, so. Let's try this case. Maybe not that one. Oh, we have a diptera. Let's have a look. Vanity. I know these probably aren't much to look at. But I figure since there's different orders here, I'll show you them. This case might be a little another dipter case. Um, let's see, got a surfity. Bunch of odd looking flies. Small. Mike Pesity. Not much to look at. Let's go see what other orders I can find. All right, we got Coleoptera. Man, that glare is really bad still. This is going to be pretty dark. Showing as well. As you see, the lights are kind of limited. I don't think they can still. See if I can find something down in the light. We have a Tenebrionity, we have Darkling Beetles. Those are 
are some impressive beetles. Yeah. So make sure uh, if you don't get that in a few days, yeah. let me know that. It's nice. You know, they did a nice job. You need a receipt for that check? This is all super awesome. I wish I could look through every single drawer, but... Unfortunately. We have some Hymenopter in here. All those are. Lumber cannons are usually pretty small. Here we have more uh, like new monody, like new bin one. Newman lost. No, kind of ended like on a more boring note. They're not as pretty as butterflies, but there we have a look out of them. I'll look around. Maybe I can find some more. All right, guys, we found some more Dictura. Um, some Silidae robber flags. Have the Lafrio. Uh, these ones are really hairy flies that tend to mimic, mimic bees. As you can see, but what I really want to show you is this drawer. Look at the size of these. These are absolutely amazing. And these ones are can be actually found here in Colorado, so that's really exciting. I'm really hoping I can find a couple for my collection. Um, uh, Midas flies. Midas flies are really cool. As you can see, these ones are here. 
with the orange wings actually mimic pumpilid wasps. And they match them in size too for the most part. And that's, those are really awesome. Snorkel flies. Here's some more Midas flies. too look at those ones these are freaking huge best way I can describe it wow 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 There really is some amazing stuff in this collection. So I found some uh, Orthoptera. And these ones clearly are not from North America. But we're... Look through them to see how gorgeous they are. The beautiful pinks, greens. And up next is my favorite box. Actually taking the top off for this one. Look at that. Aren't these absolutely beautiful? Pink, purple, orange. Doesn't get any better than that. See, so grasshoppers can be extremely pretty as well. Let's go see what else we can find. Hey guys, so if you've been enjoying this video, just so much stuff. Some needles, but I think I'm gonna very last stuff to look through are the Sissendelini tiger beetles. These are just some of the drawers. You see how absolutely gorgeous and awesome they are. I also set aside a couple of drawers out here too to look at. It's this Indella Pulchra. Let's see how amazingly awesome the species is. And 
And here we have uh, Emblicala cylindriformis. And these are massive tiger beetles. These are actually flightless. There's some more flightless tiger beetles there. And yeah, some uh, more flightless uh, Omis species. But yeah, awesome, amazing collection here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I'm hoping to spend a lot more time going through stuff and visiting here and all that stuff. So hopefully get some more sweet videos from in the specimens from this collection. Um, so comment, like, subscribe. Any uh, favorite insects that you found today, comment below. Um, thank you guys for watching and keep on bugging.